Well, hello family. Jimmy and I are so excited to have a weekend in town finally. We have desperately missed our favorite bass fishing lake that is local to us. So we got a cove over here, tons of trees, lots of space. We're about to set up camp and then we're gonna get to fishing. So uh, let's do it. Jimmy found a little creature on our chair. Hello there, Mr. Caterpillar. I shall name you Robethan. I don't think that's even a name, but it could be. He's like a Viking king, probably. Goodbye, Mr. Caterpillar. All right, so about to set up the tent, but there is one thing we can do to make this process a little funner. <laughs> we forgot our we forgot our shot glasses though. So. <laughs> we always do. We literally we can count on it. it. Classic coffee mugs. We're very classy. From These are like, like 1980s. <laughs> oh my gosh, look! The vehicle on there is from the 80s, I think. Wow, that is so funny. These are Daddy's um, shot glasses. That's Jimmy's dad. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Go. Set up a tent. <laughs> yep. Yo, bros, got the tent set up. It's a good day. Dude, it's been so long since we've been camping. I'm so excited. Also, side note, check out this freaking awesome fan I got that hangs. It's battery, it's rechargeable battery, has a light on the front, multiple settings, also extra, um, battery storage you can plug stuff into it and charge your devices off of it in like emergency type situation we bought it at this very fancy store it's called walmart um <laughs> yes it was only uh 20 bucks dude so oh yeah hit up walmart man get you a camping fan <laughs> it's got a it's got a hook to hang a clip to clip and a stand to stand <laughs> oh cheat I can't do this by What's myself. What's up with these gross kid socks? I apparently snuck some of the kid socks on the trip. I don't know. <laughs> Can you help me? I can't do this. A two. I need help. The I'm sheet. trying to help you. Damn it, two twos. Okay. Okay. Phew. That's good. Okay. Ow. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> that was unintentional. I was eating nacho chips. Oh my God, let's show them. Cause like these are insane. Okay, so as you all know, probably if you're followers, whatever, fam, um, we are keto and these Quest chips are insane. Bro, Walmart, they're so like $2 good. and something a bag. So they're a little pricey, but. Yeah, but. But you get 18 grams like of protein and there's like no carbs. There's like it's no. It's made it's out like of milk. It's the weirdest thing four ever. Four carbohydrates per bag. These bags are pretty good size. And it's got freaking 140 calories and it's made out of like milk protein. I don't even know what the hell that means, but these are delicious. I wish this video was sponsored by Quest because I eat so much Quest shit. If I could get free Quest shit, oh my God. Hey, I listen, would have so if much you're out there trying to be low carb, I've lost 44 pounds, Chelsea. Oh my God, this feels like a weight loss ad. Yeah. I've lost 35 pounds eating Quest. <laughs> <laughs> I've lost 44 pounds though, for real. Low yeah, carbing, really low carbing and exercise obviously, but so, not even that like crazy of exercise, just like basically low. Weightlifting. Yeah, I mean. I like, did yoga, so like I lost 35 pounds and i only did yoga and a little walking like that's about it and, and walking we just was very and sparse, we just do a lot. low carb diet low carb diet when you're lazy ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. yeah there's camp there's fishing let's go baby about to link up with some bass i don't know if that for certainty but i feel very confident right now that chelsea and i are gonna link up with something good Dude, look how sick the spot is, man. So excited. Look how clear the water is here. Jimmy's been fucking around for a while trying to get the fish in. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> but dude, seriously, this is ideally a very sick fishing spot. So hopefully we can link up with something good tonight. What do you think about that, Chi Chi? I would really like that a lot. So 
So I absolutely love Loafers Bend West for camping. It's a gorgeous area, really well spaced out, stuff like that. But this was my trial to see if I actually enjoyed the fishing spot. As you all probably know, the fishing was skunk last time and we fished it for a couple hours today and it was skunk again. So we're gonna go to one of our like kind of well-known areas that are better fishing. I'm not fishing Loafers Bend again. For me, it's a two strike rule and that was the second strike. So like, yeah, no for fishing, but yes for camping. Let's move on. Chit chit. Yeah. You better catch me a fishy chit chit. Why is that? If you don't, there's big trouble, big trouble. It's fishy time, fishy time. Eight. Big trouble if I don't get to fish. Big trouble! What does big trouble mean? You don't want to know. <laughs> Fishy. I, oh my gosh, it's a baby striper. Really? Oh my god, look at him. Or, no, it's, no, a, it's white a white bass. bass. It it's a, a white bass. bass, yeah. He's a, just really small. That's so cute. And we got this on the lure. Thank you, from, Tony. Ow. <laughs> Snag myself. Yeah. It's Tony's lure from In Fishing Nation. He gave yep. us a brand new set of lures. Like, pretty dope. Pretty cool. And it caught a little fishy. Well, First fish bass. of the day, we'll take it. <laughs> wow. I swear to God, this is not a fucking turtle. All right, chill on that bombs. Okay, I swear to God. If this is another effing turtle, I'm going to F that effing turtle up. Wow. <laughs> there you go, see, James said, be careful of the F bombs. You're welcome. Now that. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag family friendly channel. Mm, no. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, did you keep getting bites? But what is it? A turtle. To put it lightly. <laughs> I don't know. This isn't going well, Chichi. Okay. We're not catching any fishies. Well, you need to do better. <laughs> you need to do better. You need to do better, Chichi. You just need to do... I'm out here slaving away, and you're just over here just doing do nothing. <laughs> Except for catching the only fish we've caught all day. But... He was so tiny. Exactly. <laughs> I don't even feel accomplished. Okay, we gotta catch a fish, dude. This is serious. This is serious business. Yeah, We're I've in a good trying. spot. We need to yeah, try harder, Chichi. It's no, ridiculous. The bite is off today. I don't care. I don't care if you're friggin' care if your llama just died. You need to focus up and fish, all right? I don't think so, DG. GG, don't sass me. Tiny little uh, white bass, yeah. But it does feel good to have a fish, huh? Yeah, at least it's something, bro. <laughs> Is this Tony's lure again? Yeah. Nice. Oh, look, and I didn't even get him on the treble hook. I got him off the- Oh, wow, that extra hook. That's yeah. cool. It's pretty sweet. Hell yeah. Good job. I, dude, I knew when, as soon as I saw these though, and I told you, I was like, dude, these lures are going to kill on white bass. Yeah, you were so right. That's, that is literally exactly what he said when we were on the jetty fishing with him. Now, of course, these are kind of small white bass, but that's not really the lure's fault. I'm pretty sure it's just that's what's Let's in the area currently. Let's do a little slow -mo. Yeah, okay. A lot bigger than yours, too, too. Wow, it actually is. Though. It's a lot bigger. See that? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't appreciate what you're implying, TT. Well, that's not what I was implying, uh, but I see your point. But no, I just meant my fish was bigger than your fish. I obviously don't have a fish in that reference. <laughs> what are you talking about? Nice catch, babe, too. All right, so my bobber went underwater twice. Now I'm reeling in the slack to see what's going on. Pretty sure there's a fish at it. <sighs> this bay fishing has been very frustrating so far. Hopefully it proves to be decent. 
or I yeah, just had be my nice mask if, stolen. It'd be nice if we catch something decent tonight, but so far it's just some little sand bass. Hey, at least we're catching fish at the other place. We yeah. weren't going to catch anything, so I'm going to call That's it a win. That's true. I feel like the bite is off today, though. A little bit, but it's also, I mean, no one's caught anything except us, so the fact that we're catching white bass, I'll take it. I'd love, see, like, the thing about white bass is I like catching white bass. But I prefer to catch a lot of them if it's a white bass day. So as long as we catch like 10 or more, I'm happy. If we catch less than 10, I'm unhappy. But not like actually, just like, was that a good fishing day? You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Fish on, baby. All right, this is number four. Again, if we hit 10, I'm happy. If we don't, we've got a problem. <laughs> what? All right. It's Wait. a drum? Wow, it's a drum. That is very It doesn't strange. count. We've only gotten three. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very surprised that you hit this. This is the second time we've caught in a drum out here on a lure, though. How odd. Well, I guess never mind. The other one was a carp. The you ready? Buffalo. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go. All right, Jimmy's on again. Yeah. This he's, is... he's actually giving me some good little tugs every is now he? and then. <laughs> <laughs> this would be number four if it's a white bass. Yeah. Fifth fish, but number four white bass if it's a white bass. He's decent size. He's not big, but he's he's definitely look I mean look at my butt. He's definitely a little wow, he's tiny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a monster. I foul hooked him a little bit. That's he's why. like I would say he's probably like arguably as big as that forty two inch redfish you caught off the jetty. I mean, wow. Look at that guy. Yeah, he's a beast. <laughs> I mean, I don't even know how I landed him on this gear. It's pretty shocking. And you didn't even have to net him. I mean, wow. The skill. <laughs> Sweet. Nice. Large mouth? What is that? That was on a shad, a dead shad. Catfish, wow. I no, this was catfish. on the minnow. Oh. I was like putting the pole back in the rocks and then he slammed it. You mean it. my pole? Yeah. I just re You just reeled a fish on my pole after you messed it up. Two, I just, yeah, I messed it up. I recasted oh my God. and I was putting it up and he was slammed it. I would like to go on record that this is my fish and this is also <laughs> bull crap. Look what Jimmy did to my line and refused to fix. Look at this. Do you see this? It's because he caught it with no, his fork. No, I didn't refuse to fix it. I was about to fix it. That is it. my catfish. <laughs> you wouldn't fix it. I had to recast it. TG, don't you talk to me about this. He's, this is my oh catfish. God, look at the size of the turd he's taking. That's disgusting. It's because he was so disgusted at the fact that you just reeled in my fish without even, even telling me it was my fish. I don't know what's going on with that. He's like I think you should let him go. Ew. Anyway, um, nice little channel catfish. Okay. Let's let him go now. I don't want All to stare right. at the turn anymore. It's All right. All right, Tucci just commented about how fast I was getting to the phone. He was like, wow, look at you. I may or may not have, but definitely did pass the phone two times before getting it live. Wow. Wow. Got another Shandbosh. Shandy? Dude, the, these lures though from Oh. oh my god, James! I'm so sorry, buddy. You apologize to that fish. I'm so sorry, buddy. Tell him there goodbye, go. poor baby. Anyway, Jesus <laughs> Christ, what were these you These lures from um, in in fish Nation, man, they're killing it on the uh, white bass. We're gonna bass. get we're gonna get child protective services called on us for that baby fish just getting smacked upside the head with a rock. Dude, we're like, it's very important for us to take good care of the fish because we do do catch and release, so obviously we're not trying to like screw fish up. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Sometimes stuff happens.
alrighty. So fishing did not go terrible today. It was like maybe five sand bass, a catfish, and a drum. But obviously it wasn't like the best day of fishing ever. So we're back at camp now. Um, we wanted to do some cooking at camp and uh, some filming and stuff like that for you guys for camp life. And then we'll be back on the water tomorrow trying to land some more fishes. Hopefully we get something decent. It was still really fun, even though it wasn't like the most amazing day. But anyways, on to camp. Here we go. Dude, I love camping so much. Yeah, it's like, okay, so here's kind of the predicament we're in right now. So me and Jimmy are talking about, we want to keep camping throughout the summer because obviously we've been traveling a lot. And yeah. so we want to make even the summer months count for camping out here at Loafers Bend. But the thing is we need like an air conditioning unit. So this tent has been Jimmy's for like years. Dude, I don't even know how long. But on the other hand so it's like nostalgia versus like like workability because we want to get an air conditioning unit for the campsite so that we can stay cold in the summer times at night so we might have to get another tent which is going to be kind of weird having Guys, like a new tent i love the outdoors and i love camping so much but there's one thing and one thing only that i absolutely just cannot take <laughs> and that is sleeping in warm weather he i doesn't do heat at all i have to sleep in a cool temperatured environment <laughs> my job <laughs> my job is to save people money on their electricity and my electric bill is horrendous because james keeps our house wow. so cold <laughs> you dude <laughs> our usage is just high <laughs> <laughs> That's a bad one. Uh, you're a bad one. That's a bad one. Guys, okay, like, real talk. Like, tell me honestly. I trust my fam, okay? What do you think of the new hair thing? Like, is it weird or like, is it cool? I like- You can't really see it very well right now. You need it yet. Yeah, but they've seen it. I yeah, mean, yeah. we've now watched like probably, I'm gonna estimate eight there to 10 minutes of video. So yeah, it's like, I don't know what you think. Like, is it good? Is it cute? Or is it like, wow, you've got issues. I don't know. <laughs> wow, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get the kebabs okay. going, girl. So we got these like pre-done veggies from Walmart's because we're cheap. <laughs> well, except for with traveling. We spend a lot of money traveling. It's really where all our money goes is traveling, but anyway. So, yeah, and we got some pre-sliced. And retirement. We got some pre-sliced <laughs> sirloin kebab meat. Oh, and, and oh man, we got to get the wish on that. Oh, what? Our money goes to traveling and retirement. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Yeah. <laughs> retirement, for sure. Retirement. Mm. Yeah, that's we what that. happens. <laughs> we do that. <laughs> Guys, 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 we're responsible. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I could be a teacher. <laughs> You'd be the worst teacher I've ever been. <laughs> okay. okay. All right. We need the Wishire sauce. Okay. Where's that? Which is somewhere over there. Oh my God. By, behind the liquor. <laughs> <laughs> Which there battle? it is. Okay, there got it. There it is. Okay. okay. All right. Let's, I'm gonna wishire up the steaks. All right, guys, we'll be back. We'll be back be in back. a second. Yeah, we're wishire-ing the vegetables. Is it just me or like, is is the way you say wishire always wrong? It's Worcestershire. Like in the country when I, where I grew up, it was Worcestershire, Worcestershire. And then I'm like Worcestershire, but I really don't know. <laughs> like. Dude, I don't think anybody knows really, though, how to really properly say that word. I don't like, think... I think everybody it's... Everybody says it differently, and it's just like, nobody really knows. Worcestershire. Worcestershire. <laughs> it's just something. It's Worcestershire. just... Worcestershire. Why? Worcestershire. Okay, hold on. Okay. Let's just call this out. First of all, Worcestershire, you did an amazing job. Love your stuff. Dude, it's great. I put on everything. But my point is, like... <laughs> 
why did you make your work so complicated? That's kind of on you a little bit. I mean, like you could have just called it like saucy sauce. Like you could have made it really simple and it, or steak sauce, but instead it's like <laughs> spelled with like a thousand letters. I mean, this is not my fault. Jamesy. Do you guys feel that? What is it? I think I feel the rain coming. Wow, <laughs> you're so bum. <laughs> this is a new vodka we've just recently tried out. So it's just, it's all right. It's not, I don't know. It's, it's pretty good, but yeah, it's distilled seven times. So obviously the more times it's distilled, the smoother, the better, the cleaner it is, but it's all right, man. One of my other favorites is uh, 360. 360 is like definitely the best. You guys always basically see us on our off days. So yeah, we drink some, you know, just a little bit. Like, you know, we like to drink a little bit on our off days. It is what it is. But yeah, like, ugh, I really like 360. It's fire. Like that's good stuff. But anyways, tomorrow morning, I know this time lapse is gonna be super awkward for y'all because you know, you see it as it comes out and sometimes it's a little scrambly because of the footage we get versus the time we have to edit that footage and stuff like that. But anyways, tomorrow morning we're editing the giveaway. I am so stoked to see who wins the DJI drone. Um, we're actually adjusting the way that we film our giveaway videos and I am super psyched about it. Oh my God, it's gonna be awesome. Anyways, I can't wait to see who wins. That is all. Get these coals nice and hot, bruh. Oh man, we about to have some steak kebabs, bro. Some veggies. That's what's up. And some super yummy beans. Okay, this is like low-key, but I feel like a little bit of a secret recipe, but it's probably really not a secret recipe at all. But you guys gotta try it. I'm about, I'm about to show you in just a minute. Jimmy's family nails these beans hardcore, and it's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be good. It's like a family recipe, I think. But it could have come from Google. I have no idea. Dude, it's probably from But it's Google. so good. And I'm sure there's something on Google that, you know, gives out this recipe. But it is very yummy. And if you don't know about it, I highly suggest. I didn't know about it before I met them. So, like, I'm pretty psyched about eating them. It's going to be awesome. I don't know. I got a new brush. I like it. So just out of curiosity, do you have to say boom every time? Yes. Boom. Guys, I'm so in love with our Jeep. Side note. Oh no. Wow. Okay. I can't do it. I gotta put the lid on it. Just do it. Boom. Where's the lid? Oh gosh. I don't know where the lid's at, man. Yes, that's gonna be delicious. Got set can opener, so I don't know what's gonna happen here, but I'm very nervous. Oh my god. I said, Jimmy, you might stab yourself, and he said, I would rather have it on film. <laughs> Overall, I would advise bringing a can opener for cans. No, no, punch it down more, punch it down more, go through. You know what I mean? No, no, no. Okay. Do they smell amazing though? So I don't know. Bro, it smells so good. Okay, we're just gonna have to like. Okay, I feel like that'll, that'll work. That'll work. That'll we'll work. We'll just have to like, you know, really work it out. Yeah, you got it. You know, just like, work it out. We could maybe leave the veggies for a little longer, but I definitely want to pull the steak. Hell yeah. I agree 100%. The steak should come out first. Let's go. Oh yeah. Oh. 
So these bamboo skewers kind of fell apart. It's like, why are they called skewers if they can't skewer? It's out of control. We forgot ours at home, so we like... The metal ones. Yeah. So we like pulled a move last second trying to find something mm -hmm. to make it happen. I'm so hungry. <laughs> How's my steak, oh Gigi? Mm. Is it good? Oh my god. Is it good? Oh my god, you're, I want one too. Mm -hmm. So basically it's like a, it's a can of jalapeno beans, half packet of ranch dressing. The one that's in the like dry packet. The Hidden Valley. Yeah, Hidden Valley. Packet. Yep. And then half a thing of cream cheese. These are so effing good. They're so effing good, dude. It's insane. And by effing, I mean freaking. They're so freaking good. <laughs> Appropriateness. Bro. Here's these beans. Oh yeah, let's go. The beans. What do you think, babe? Chief? How oh, we do? Yeah. Mm. Bro, I don't even like beans, but when you add cream cheese and ranch, dude, those are fire. It's fire. So fire. Fire beans. A nightmare that I frequently just happened to me where I was trying to shower and it said there was children in the room and I was like, I, I need to get my clothes off. And they were like, oh, it's fine. And I was like, I don't feel comfortable with this at all. And ew. And that was kind of what happened. That was horrible. I will have nightmares about this for a while. It's a very calm evening out, Chi Chi. There's no wind. Got a lantern. Got a hangy light. You wanted me to talk about my trauma and then you immediately directed the conversation elsewhere. I will literally beat your fucking ass. Like, I am so. That is not even what happened. To that me. is exactly what happened just now. You asked me to talk about it and then you changed the subject. Like, wow. Guys, I just want you guys I'm all to know. <laughs> I want everybody, the whole fam, to know that this T over here has been very sassy today. I have been very saucy today. She's but been so is, saucy. You just did. You did do it. Everything and anything is my fault. So let's just prepare ourselves for that and realize that that's reality. <laughs> but like anything and everything. You do understand right now. Tutu you're has no, no to blame. The fam right now, but at the same time, like you're alone with me right now. So <laughs> you should think about that. <laughs> You should think about that. Listen, I've thought about this, this guys. This night could go fam, really good for you. Fam, or I thought. Fam, really good for you. I thought about this. Ew, ew, I fucked some ew. And everything, and anything is all my fault tonight. It's all my fault. Maybe it is. Yep, it is. It's all my fault. Hmm, you did it. You're a baby. I don't think that's a thing though. I got bugs all over me right I now. Know. Okay, there we go. Some lighting. You have a bug on your face. You have a massive bug on your face, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> Why did you flick it at me? That was rude. Oh my gosh, dude. No. Like We're you. in the light, so we keep literally getting bugs all over us right now. There's just bugs everywhere, and they're going in our drinks like hardcore. It's really gross. Like our Dr. Pepper has bugs, our Red Bull has bugs, and any other drinks we're having has bugs. There's literally a huge bug on the screen right now Ugh. as we're filming. I can see it. Ew. There's a huge God, bug on the screen. So gross. All right. Good morning, guys. It is day two out at Lake Whitney. We are headed over to our fishing spot. Super stoked to get hopefully onto a decent fish today. Um, let's get after it. Yay.
If you find yourself out fishing Lake Whitney, be sure to visit the Waffles Fam favorite bait shop, Cornerstone Bait and Tackle. Um. Nailed it. What just happened exactly? I don't know, Judy. <laughs> <laughs> You just um, tried to kill me with your poles, basically. Well, <laughs> don't act like you've tried to do that before. <laughs> if I feel as though a minnow has done a good job, and you get to, like, we're about to move from one spot to another spot, and this guy, I don't know what is up with him, but he did not get hit, he did not get interest, even though he's just swimming his little heart out. And so he deserves to live, so I'm gonna release him. <laughs> <laughs> Slow-mo release. Slow-mo release. Look at that. <laughs> Dude down the way hooked us up with some big gizzard set, gizzard shad. Some home shad some home caught massive shad. We're gonna lob it. Lob that bitch. I go more center of the... Lob it. Guys, I'm so pacey. It's like a serious problem I have. To go home. I don't want to go home. <laughs> you need to. Can't <laughs> trust you with that camera. All right. If we catch something on it, we'll... What's your name? Jesse. Jesse? Yeah. Good to meet you, man. Is it right. okay if I film you? Oh, sure. Okay. <laughs> All right, we just ran into one of the fam. He's hooking us up with some bait. We're going to try and carp in a little bit. So, super excited about that. Oh, good luck. <laughs> Guys, it is so weird. There was like one guy on the um, freaking thing when we get here his name was Chris and then he was like fishing next to us for a while or we were fishing next to him because he was there first I guess but anyway um, and then like another guy rolls up and he's like oh look the waffles family and I'm like oh my god so like he he knew who we were <laughs> and he wanted to give us a bait to try out tonight and then um, Chris uh, also had just watched our videos last night it's really weird like we're not even that large of a channel yet but like we've been running into the fam like crazy lately. It just yeah. seems like in Port A we ran into people. We run into people like almost every fishing spot at this point. It's just crazy, man. It's pretty awesome. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. We love you, fam. Love you, fam. You literally caught that on film, but I just caught all my hand hair on fire. Wow. What you doing, James? All right, guys, so um, the fishing hasn't gone, like it hasn't been bad, but it hasn't been good either. So um, we're, we were here earlier before lunch and um, we seen, we're spotting a lot of really good sized carp. So we're like, dude, heck it, man. Let's get some good carp fights in. We haven't carp fished in a long time, kind of miss it. Yeah, so carp are super fun to fight and there's some big ones. So we're gonna try and land, hook up, with some big chunky cop yeah right Got she is something. on guys finally jesus oh it's a car really oh. <gasps> yeah, he's oh, probably wow. not gonna be probably not gonna be able to land him but do you want me to get the net oh uh, nice. yeah we're gonna need the pier net yeah, yeah for sure. okay let's let's try here we go go look at the gar okay wow who'd have thought dude this we were not rigged really up for gar dirty. We're definitely not rigged up for God. Okay, here we go. Sink okay. net. I need that okay. net to sink. There it goes. Okay. It's starting to sink. Try to. Oh, you got the rope? Yeah, I got the rope. I'm gonna try and get him. Okay. Over the top of it. Wow, that's crazy. I did not right, expect that. You didn't even have a steel leader like at all. Okay. Come on, this way. Oh, he got. Oh shit! He got off. Oh, he did. Yeah. 
then that's what messed it up. He's still right there. He's, hold on. I don't know if he's caught in the net. Try pull up him. His teeth is caught in the net. <gasps> oh. oh man, that was cool. Wow. He snapped the line. He well, I'm sure line. he snapped the line. I can't believe he stayed on that line. That was a very yeah. fine line. That was fun, but yeah, I was not. I wasn't rigged for a guard. Either. No, I, didn't, I haven't seen any guard all day. That was literally the first guard I've even spotted. That yeah. was cool. That was cool. I did. That sucks lost that guard but I wasn't I would literally I wasn't planning on landing him I was like he's gonna get off but it's like 10 we pounds almost we, were, got we went him. on clear line 10 pound line yeah what happened was the pier net his teeth got stuck in the pier net for a second but then I guess he either cut or something the pier net handle so we had to tie it back on so it didn't work out but and we keep spotting, I'm surprised we kept on that long honestly we keep spotting a freaking like eight pounder seven pounder down here at large mouth say he's like six seven seven then okay but yeah, he's a big boy. But he doesn't he's not interested. like my minnow. Yeah, he's not interested at all. in our bait though. We put it like right in front of him. He was like, no. <laughs> Finally. Okay, hopefully it's not a guard. Jesus, oh. we're looking for a large mouth or a he's striper. He's going in that tunnel. What? Okay. Oh gosh. He's not that big though. My drag's not. Okay. I don't think he is. Jesus. Well, he's mad, that's for sure. He seems very mad. Dude. Come on, James, bring it in. All right. Get that fishy, get that fishy. I think it might be a drum or something, dude. I don't know what's going on here. Something. Oh! No, it was a gar. Was it a gar? <sighs> Check your line, see if it's, if it's. I think he got me on the side of the. Well, See where it snapped, because I want to know if it was a guard, because then we just need to throw a steel leader on. You're kidding me, man. I keep getting... It, Jimmy's already missed like three today, and then he lost the guard, so he's getting a little pissed. Dude, he was on it. I mean, my drag's... Look, okay, here's how tight my drag is. It's kind of... It's pretty... It's not real tight, but he was like screaming that. Yeah. It might have been a guard, dude. I don't know. Well, what happened? Did you not come off? I don't know, it's hard to say, man. Jimmy is on a freaking carp. Dude, the pole was like freaking slamming, dude. He's going this way, he's going this way. Okay, I need to get the net. I need to get the net ahead of time before we have a situation. It's gotta be a freaking tank. I mean, he's at least. Dude, I don't, it's hard to tell. God. Okay. Okay, yeah. Dude. Whatever it is, it's a good size. My drag is pretty tight. But also, look at that bow. I don't want to... I got to wear him out, dude. I don't want to try to force him. No, definitely not, dude. And snap it up again. Definitely not. Dang, dude. Yes. Oh. Oh. Dude, please. I don't want to lose another fish today, dude. dude. I've lost enough. <laughs> Seriously though. Dude, look at that bow, dude. Yeah, this is a pretty dense pole. <sighs> He's swimming all around. He's also, going back and forth. Permission to use my pole. <laughs> <laughs> he just stole it. I didn't even realize you were using my pole until just now. Oh my gosh, I gotta go under this. Yeah. Crap, I can't. There we go. Okay. Come on, baby, come up. He's like just pinned to the bottom, dude. He's like, I don't want you to see me. He's very, he's very uh, private with his. Uh... Look at him, it's just he's swimming all around, dude. I can see where the line's going. He's like, <laughs> where are you going? All right, he's going to the shallows. Okay. Might be able to well, see. Well, cool. We'll probably be able to see him then. You can see in the shallows pretty well. Dude, he is traveling. Oh my god, I want to see him so bad, dude. Okay. No, don't go that way now. <laughs> He's in the shade. Uh, uh, wow. Uh, uh, dude. Whatever it is, he's definitely decent, dude. Well, he has to be a carp. There's nothing, nothing else. A catfish could possibly, well, but. Well, catfish could eat corn, but that oh, would be a freaking tank. Yeah, it's a big carp. I saw him for a second. He's going out in the light. 
Okay, come up. There you he is. just tell me when on the net. I think it's a buffalo. Makes sense. Oh, oh, there he is. Here, let me zoom in. Is that a large mouth? No way. No way. No, that's a carp. It's yeah. a carp. Okay. Whew. All right, nice. let's try. Dude, he's... that's a pretty freaking big fish. Dude, he's a pretty he's pretty good size. That's a big boy. All right, let's uh Nice. Let's get the net. And this is why we carp fish. Dude, cuz the fight is epic. Dude, that's a tank. Wow. Look at him. We're like way up here, like that's a big fish. Let's get him up. Here we go. All right, guys. Big carp on. Trust is going to drop the net. Very big carp. Okay. Net's okay. in. All right, I'm going to set you guys down for just a second to get him in the net because, yeah, I don't. Or, yeah, I'll hold him. Yeah. Hey, guys, I'm going to hold you now. <laughs> we got to get him navigated way over here, which is. Honestly, always more difficult than you want it to be. Pier fishing can be challenging for this reason. <laughs> come on, come this way. Come on, you're almost there, big boy. You're tired, I'm tired. Everybody's tired except me, who's never even hooked come a fish on, today. Just a little further this way. Okay, come up. Come up. Slow. Slow. Oh. oh. Hold on. Go back down slow. No, wow. no, no. Keep it where it's at. Okay. You got it. Okay. Um, come up. Come up. Oh, cr is he in? No, he's like half there in. There he goes. There he is. He's in. Okay. Oh, he's... oh my God. He's so heavy, babe. Can All you right, do here. this? You film. Okay. Grab the pole. Okay. I got this. Okay. I got it. Dude, I just felt I'll not slip. Okay. Dude, that's a freaking tank. Dude, he's heavy as crap. He's so heavy, dude. Really I kind of want to weigh him. Can you weigh a carp? Okay. Dude, it hurts my wrist to pull it. I know, dude, because he's freaking huge. Bro. Good thing Jimmy goes to the gym. Jesus. Wow. All right, big boy. Bro. You did it. Woo! Oh my freaking gosh. Yeah, he's a, he's a beast, bro. That is a huge boy. Look at him. Uh, let's see what we got going on here with this. Can know. you weigh a carp without hurting him? Yeah, you can put it in their gill plate. Okay, let me get the scale. That's what he weighs. We'll have to calculate that later. Okay. All right. All right. Look at that, dude. Uh, it's a boy. <laughs> he's a fatty, dude. Like a Thick he is. <laughs> it's a chunker. It's a good fight, man. <laughs> All right, let's take some photos. Yeah. All right. Slowly. Bye, friend. Gosh. Like you gotta tell all your friends that you're famous <sighs> now. <laughs> much easier. We gotta get a bigger rope because it's much easier with the smaller rope. He's gonna need a second. He is tired. He's trying to get out, but it's not low enough. Okay. There you go, buddy. There you Bye, go. Bye, baby. So nice to meet you. He'll be all right. He's a big boy. Yes. All right, finally. Finally, a I haven't gotten like a on. bite all day. <laughs> this is on a minnow, so it's not a carp. All right, dude, I swear. Nice little sh striper. Been waiting for something all freaking day. See, like literally, just anything. I'm like, <laughs> come on, bro. Dude, finally. Uh, I don't really feel very you confident. Can get him. This line is so thin. Okay. <laughs> yeah, he's not a monster, but it's just like a light pole and a light line, so I didn't want to freaking like snap off. Okay. Oof. Well, I think we, you could have got him. Right I know. I probably could have. Hi, baby. It's so good to meet you. You're my only fish today. You mean so much to me. Oh, well, let's be calm so I can fix you. Let me see the There we go. All right, big boy. Oh, he's such a pretty boy. Hi there. What is AE lock? I don't know. All right. 
Oh. Oh, it's like hung on his mouth. There you go. There he goes. All right, buddy. Yay me. At least I caught a fish today. Ugh. Sorry, I meant freaking. <laughs> we have not done the best on this trip, but well, we're we're coming through. At least we're yesterday, getting, we're catching fish. At least just... yesterday we caught like five or six or seven, something like that. But they were all small. But at least we were still catching. That's fun. But all day today, I've just been chasing a bite, dude. Ugh. <laughs> all right. Nice. Good job. Too. But that carp was really cool. That was like maybe five minutes ago, so that was pretty quick back to back. But all right, I'm gonna put this guy back in. Well, we had a ton of fun camping out at Lake Whitney this weekend. Um, it was really cool getting to just like do camp live, grill out, all that kind of stuff. And of course, the fishing was awesome. Um, we caught some white bass, a small striper, and a carp. It was a really weird combo, but it's always a good time. We've got some really sick videos out at Whitney catching like some massive stripers and some good large mouse and stuff like that. So if you want to check out the channel, we've got tons of content on that. Um, and if you're not subscribed, be sure to do so. Join the fam and keep traveling with us, fishing with us. See you next time.